Hey Junior today, and I have a word for you guys. It's about how to get into heaven. Can your mom and dad get you to heaven? No. Can your brother get you to heaven? No. Can anybody that you love or no get you to heaven? No. You wanna know how you can get to heaven? God. You have to love God. You have to read the word. You have to go to church every Sunday. Get the word. And yes, that's how you get, that's how you can get to heaven. So pretty much what you're saying is nobody else relationship other than yours can get you into heaven, right? Yeah. So With meaning God. So mean it's an, it's important for you to have your own relationship with Christ, right? Yes. And having your own relationship with God, does that require you praying to God? Yes. Does that require you reading his word? Mm -hmm. Does that require you when you're in school to tell other people about Christ? Yes. Or wherever you're at? Mm -hmm. So when you play football, who do you play football for? God. And, and then second, your teammates. Third, your family. Amen. How long have you been going to church? Um, since I was 11, I mean, yeah. 11 years. Can you remember the first time that, like, you ever had a troubled situation or something hurt you and you really had to pray to God? Um, not failing my class. Okay. So, like, there was a time where you thought you was going to fail, so instead you prayed to God and asked God to give you the strength. Uh-huh. Amen. I just want to say thank you, man. Thank you for taking the time out today and encouraging these young people about how good God is. How many gods are there? One. Is money a god? No. But what if people choose money to be their god? It can be, though, right? Yeah. So that's why how many masters can you serve? One. Right. So is money the root of all evils? No. Is it the love of money the root of all evils? So that's why you have to keep God over what? Money. And that's why you can't serve two masters, right? Yep. Well, you know what, man? I just want to encourage you just to continue to be a young man of God. Continue to read his word. You know, you're going to be great. You know, you're walking in your own footsteps. You have your own path with Christ. And that's what is so amazing, man. I just want to just thank God for you. Thank God for you today giving the word at this campsite that we're at right now. As you guys can see, we are at campsite. And Mr. DeAndre God Saves Jr. just gave his word. So you have a blessed day. Do you mind praying with the people before we leave, sir? Um, can you give me like a subject, please? Just just pray whatever God puts on your heart. Matter of fact, just pray for all the kids that's just now going to school. Dear God, I pray that you watch over all the kids that are going to school. I pray that they do a good job in, in the schoolwork. And I pray that they're not, they don't want to be like other kids in school who are, who are having ads. Pray that they listen to your music or they listen to other music. They, oh, they feel different, Lord. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen.